You know, I have a question for Tina Slay Richardson. You could hate me all you want, that's fine. I never did anything to you, but I'd like to know. Why aren't you focused on the men who killed your son? You're not going to get justice just hating me. Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I'm glad you're here, glad you're stopping by. i just shown you a clip that, um, for all intents and purposes, is kind of disturbing. Um, you know... As a human being, as a person, you're bound to say stupid things. You're bound to slip. And sometimes you have to check morality before you say something completely inexcusable. I'm sorry, I'm trying to get my way. I'm exhausted, really exhausted. Um, I've been putting, a, putting it in pretty well to gyms, a swimming pool over YMCA, um, and all this. So kind of bear with me uh and this is actually late i said i was going to get this video out today and by god i'm going to get it out today one way or the other is happening uh so yeah um so you watch that video you watch the beginning of the intro and a lot of questions came to mind how could you if somebody on a high platform let's just face it sweetie's got you know, a little over 40 some thousand followers. That's quite a bit. I mean, even like my, I, I may never ever get there, but you know, it's possible. I didn't think I was going to get to almost 1500, which by the way, if you haven't already, feel free to hit that button so we can get to 1500. We're almost there. But when, you would figure if you are at a high point, if you have uh, a platform that a lot of people watch, a lot of people look up to you. And let's face it, there's a lot of people, a lot of crazy people that look up to him. And it's weird. I don't understand it. But then again, you know, that's just me. But I don't know how you can justify saying something like that. Uh, the thing about Tina Slay, and I, you know, I've got to talk to Tina Slay maybe once or twice on whenever she shared a stream. Um, and she said something about her son that really like resonated with me um something you know i love he shared um he he loved too uh and i was pokemon i know again i talk about pokemon a lot it means a lot to me i'm i know it's weird uh just bear with me it's just one of those things i'm a nerd see got see big pokemon tattoos yeah i'm i'm a weirdo I, i'm a nerd can't help it. But how can you, as a human being, prop somebody's child that they lost in a horrific way? I mean, any way is bad. You know, you losing your son and your daughter, uh, anybody really. But how could you use that to try to drive some kind of point? Don't you think that's inappropriate? I would expect an apology. Honestly, I would. That's that's beyond disturbing, dude. And, you know, I'm being real right now. I'm being real right This is not me trolling you. And I hope you're watching. But you, you, you have a platform, dude. You have a lot of people watching you. You know, I don't know how many of those are fake. Could be fake, just my opinion. I don't know that. But why would you do that? Why would you bring her son in, try to prop her up for profit while saying something to her, which is clearly not your business in the first place? You know, I don't care what happened prior. All I know is Tina got hurt by you. You won't admit it. You'll say she's defaming you. I believe her. I believe her. You know, when she talks about this, I believe her. I don't know. I don't think she's lying at all. I think she's telling the truth. I think you're not telling people the full story. You're deflecting. But it's disgusting that you're using her son as a target. How could you do that to a grieving mother? What the fuck are you, man? Honestly, honestly, what are you? 
What's your deal, dude? What where where are you getting that? I you you have no authority. No authority to talk about her son at all. You have no authority to do that. You should stop doing it. You should apologize. Make it right. You talk about being a good human. You talk about being a good person. But you do stuff like that. And, you know, you say super shit all the time. But that takes the cake. And it's disturbing. I don't know why you would do that. I don't know why you would do something like that. I mean, a lot of pro people probably already, you know, they know that. They know you're capable of doing that. They expect it. You know, I don't know you in the short time I do, like, had experience with you. Like, if that's me covering you on this channel, that's the worst. That's one of the worst things I've seen you do, in my opinion. You can't do that. And, you know, I you know, I feel like a parent scolding you. Um, and I know you're not going to listen. You're going to say, hey, you're fat, because that's what you did earlier. By the way, I hope you liked that comeback, by the way. I hope you did. Probably tasted good. Uh, sorry, that was dirty. It's dirty. But I'm sure a lot of people in your community, and I've seen it, a lot of the comments on that video thought it was distaste, really distasteful. Really, I mean, you should you should really go back and pay attention. And I know you're going to say all those people were trolls. You could say that. You say everybody, but it's against you as a troll, and you try to censor them, which you're supposed to be a First Amendment uh, protector, but you're not. Obviously, you don't want people to hear a story, and you block it. You throw it away. Then you say something stupid, and once you get backlash, you try to backtrack. You do. Now, like I said, you say a lot of stupid shit, but that was that was probably the dumbest thing I've heard. And, you know, I haven't heard it all. I haven't heard it all. I don't know. You know there's a ton of history behind before I started covering you. I mean, there's a lot. You know, I only scratched the surface. You know, Mass Hole, uh, Team Skeptic, Josh from AFA, uh, Ironton Auditor, uh, a lot of these guys know what you're doing. But this this shocked me because, you know, I, I you know, I don't have a son or a daughter, right? I'm getting married. I can't have kids. I chose not to. Got a vasectomy. Chose not to have kids. But I have a niece and a nephew that I love so damn much. And if somebody was to say something like that, it wouldn't be good. It wouldn't just be me wanting to fight. Okay? Be a lot to it. And I'm not making threats to you. I'm not. Don't don't take that out of context. I'm sure you will. But dude, you you really need to you really need to apologize for that shit. Like bad. You need to. Do the decency, the common courtesy, be a fucking nice person for once. Don't lie. Don't try to hide beside, behind something. And I know I, I sound like I'm just scolding this whole video, but it just really worked on me. Like, like especially on the stream. When it was on the stream and you started bringing uh, her child's name up, what, what what the fuck are you thinking? You think people like that? You think people are liking that? People like drama, sure. And you do have some of your uh, fellow friends, you know, saying disgusting things. You know, I I took a screenshot of one of them. It was awful. You know, somebody who hasn't lost a kid says something to somebody that lost a kid. No. No, fucking A, dude. No way. No way. That's ridiculous. And I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Um, I'm out of energy, <laughs> I'll tell you. I'm uh I've been I've been putting it in pretty well. And that's where I, we're gonna go away from that for a moment. Uh we're done with that. Um I said I think I had my fill. Um but you know 
I I hope I hope you guys see what I see. Uh, I hope you guys understand, and I know you do. You're smart. Uh, you guys are great. Uh, I love you very much. Every single one, even to my detractors. And I just feel bad for Tina because Tina's a good person. I like I said, I don't have a lot of time with her, and I you know I would like to get to know Tina. Um, I would like to talk to Tina. You know, I'd love to bring her up and have a, you know, talk about things. Um, but Tina, if you're watching, um, you, you didn't deserve that. Like what he did, like you didn't deserve any of that. That's, I'm sorry. I'm really am. I'm really sorry that happened to you. Like, and I'm sorry that he made that video and keeps on propping your child for profit. Not only does he want money from that, but he's also trying to get money from a childhood cancer charity fight. So but we 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 know what kind of a person he is. We do. We do. It's undeniable. But guys, again, uh I'm just gonna <laughs> I keep on going back to it. Um but let's go let's go back. I'm sorry, and this is this is a sad video, Jude. This is sad as hell. I didn't really mean it to be. Um, the th the the con the the subject of it. I mean, yeah, it's it's meant to be sad. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I definitely appreciate it. Don't stand for anything like that. And if, if you're watching this and you hate my guts and your team chili. Team Sweetie. Take a look at that video. Take a look at it. And you try to justify that. Because you can't. Just because you believe every word he says, you cannot justify that at all. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I definitely appreciate it. Be sure to hit that follow button, hit that subscribe button, or oh, actually hit that like button, hit the hit the number one, hit the like button. All right, all right. Guys, I love you very much, and I'll see you soon.